We have a really great update for you today on a story we've been following for years here on Channel 2. We also have a great way for you to get involved and give back. The idea to create the Autism Nature Trail, or ANT, at Letchworth State Park was first sparked in 2014, and ever since, the people behind it have been working to raise the necessary funding to make it reality. The recreational trail is something everyone will be able to enjoy, but is thoughtfully designed with those with autism and other developmental disabilities in mind. After all the designing, planning, and fundraising, we can now tell you, it's finally happening. The project has been put out to bid by New York State Parks, so uh, construction is imminent. And if um, the weather is kind to us um, over the next so many months, we should be fully operational for the 2021 park season. With the pandemic, Lauren says more and more people have discovered just how healing nature can be. And people have enjoyed being outside and, and I think realized that there's some people who aren't comfortable, maybe feel unwelcome in a state park setting. And uh, this has been an impetus for them to give to us and say everyone deserves to enjoy state parks. The privately funded trail will be a mile long loop with a number of sensory stations along the way. Lauren says there's really nothing else like it anywhere, making it a very unique destination, much like Letchworth itself. So what makes it so special? I like to give the example of the playful path, one, one of the, the uh, later stations. It, it, you, you can walk along the main trail, but on this path there's also intersecting segments of different surfaces that you can feel underfoot. And those may change with the seasons. Uh, it could be um, dried leaves right now, or uh, pine trees, or small gravel. And uh, some people might not notice that change in, in what it feels like underfoot. Someone with, uh, with sensory needs and sens sensitivities is going to notice it right away. Uh, that is, is a, a very specific visual and tactile uh, example of, of how each of these stations is catering to someone who, who, who has those sensory issues. They have raised three million of their ultimate $3.7 million goal. Lauren says that dollar amount will ensure the trail is staffed and maintained for its lifetime. To get there, they need help though, and Ant is holding a special virtual silent auction. It started today and runs until October 29th. It's a really unusual auction. You're not gonna find a bunch of gift baskets in this. You can learn more about what they're calling the Ant Experience by going to the Ant website, autismnaturetrail.com. And again, they're hoping the trail will be open and ready to welcome everybody by the spring.